There he goes. He's making the break for it. You can't run faster than bullets, can you, Megalodon? Ma! Hello, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator, and welcome to a new channel series called Dayton Dissects. This will be a one-off video where I basically take a look at the major points of a game and decide if I like it or not. Spoilers, I like it because I'm, I'm bothering to review it. So, you can choose to be the soldiers who have missiles or the police with guns. The uh, supposedly bad or good side, depending if you're a hippie or not, would be uh, the Omeglodon and the Enviro who is just trying to help him get to the city center to, to destroy the nuclear reactor. But we're going to be a soldier because that's what we do here. And as you can see, the graphics aren't the best, but they're definitely um, doable. You can work with it. Look at that rocket launcher! Wow! You can destroy buildings, although I probably shouldn't be destroying this building because it's uh, the military base, you know? Where the soldiers come from. Ah, oh, fuck it. Yeah! The best! There's a multitude of choices for vehicles, which is awesome, although they consume no fuel. You have helicopters and jets, and then they have ground-based uh, vehicles like tanks, and... Oh my god, oh my god, get up! Fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and everything's destructible, which is another glorious thing. See, they're like, get, get, get one of the tanks. We don't trust you in a jet, as you shouldn't. <laughs> There's a guy with a rocket launcher. Boom! I kill everybody. Everything in the game is destructible, and that's probably one of the highest points for me. You can go under these blue points unless you're the Omeglodon. The Omeglodon is restricted to a path. So that's why he needs the Enviro to heal, heal him because the military and soldiers can cluster up on him and take him down relatively easily. The turning isn't too tight in this game. No matter what kind of car you get into, the vehicles are kind of wonky. Oh, and I just got hit by a train. <laughs> the train's not wonky. The train does work, but I'll show you a semi-truck, and it's going to take some work to get out of here. You can't really adjust the camera, which is not the best, but that's okay. And the semi doesn't turn. The, the turning radius is uh, the size of about Albuquerque. Mm-hmm. It's awful. And you'd think you could remedy that by getting in another vehicle, correct? Well, let's just take this little blue sports car. It is faster, granted. But the turning radius is equally awful. And there's like a... Oh my god! There's a missile coming to kill me. That's what it is. What about a Humvee? Oh my god. I destroyed all the tents. Let's do it again. Hey, hey, hey! Watch out! Boom! It takes all the energy that I have. In the upper left corner, you have your health and your energy. Energy is basically used to shoot or to shout for the Omeglodon. He does like a Skyrim Fushoda and destroys everything around him. One of my favorite things to do probably in this game is just to destroy the trees. I rather enjoy destroying trees, making crop circles, etc. What's that over there? You can't really move the camera again. But look at that! You destroyed the gate in one hit. That was real nice. It's a parking lot? Oh, it's an airport. Well, that's wonderful. Let's destroy the control tower. Yeah! See you in hell! You and your 6k salary! 600k salary? Hmm. K 
Can we steal a plane? I'm not sure if we can steal a big plane. We fucking certainly can. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> Game is delightfully quirky. Spacebar to go up in the helicopter, control to go down, and you do kind of bounce against this invisible ceiling if you uh, keep pressing the spacebar. But that's fine, we don't mind that. Do we? That sound means somebody has spawned as the Omegalodon. So, I'll try to figure out where we are. Oh, and I have rockets on my helicopter! Helo rockets! Boosh! Sweet. Where is he? There, we must do battle. I've got my sights on the beast! And you kinda gotta adjust your height based on where he is. Got him there. Oh! He's making a break for it. Don't let him get away! Direct hit! That guy blew himself up. Hi, friend! He could see my name. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Just run? Run like a little punk? You're damn right you are. Destroy the creature! Somebody died. That's the shadow I was talking about. Who's road? And me personally, I just fly around with missiles. Go, hey, buddy. That's, far That's quite far enough. You're kind of welcome here. Did I nail that guy? Yes, get him! Make him pay for what he's done! All his crimes of e existing and trying to have a life. I have to stop him! I need to wait for my energy to recharge. He's not gonna make it though. That is almost certain. Megalodon, are you okay? He's not okay. He'll never be okay. Maha! Oh, let's get let's get a new helicopter. It's gonna be so badass. Yeah. Give me the fresh one. I think this one's a machine gun. Ooh, buddy. Is 
There he goes. He's making the break for it. You can't run faster than bullets, can you, Megalodon? Ma! March onward. March! You dirty, disgusting creature. I don't know if you can man these, uh... Oh! Yeah! Get him! Then you gotta get the next one! Oh no! He's escaping! Why did you do that? What a jack. Uh oh, we've got Enviro. Oh, nailed! Yeah! Some fine PvP action. Oh, Megalodon. It's got its moments, for sure. My health regenerates as well. We need a car. Get in the car. I think this is the car we ditched earlier. I hear the Omegalodon. I don't really want to just fight him on foot. That's not a recipe for success. Ah, the tank I ditched earlier. Good friend! Hi Ho Silva! Away! Where is he? Check the handy dandy map. Oh, he's across the water now. He's certainly making his way. He's the best little Omegalodon we've ever seen! Well, we've never seen one before. But, but still, he's, he's pretty good, isn't he? At rampaging, I mean. He's got his talents, that's all I'm saying. Look at that little cop car. I love little block-shaped things. Block games are the best. Hey, friend! We gotta go over here and get him. I think he's down this road. We must make the Omegalodon pay! Oh, hello, train friend. Now I lost that Enviro guy who was following me. Because trains. Oh, he's gone this way. Why? He suicide bombed me. Damn it. We've got no time! We've got to get the Omeglodon! Alright, this thing can fly across water. We'll be good. There he is. The disgusting creature. Wow, he's regenerated quite some health. I need to blow up that little guy that's assisting him. Oh my god! You're the one! Ah, my energy's low! He's well on his way. Hi friend! I'm still here. Well, I did go away for a while. But I'm back now! Oh, did you miss me? Of course you did. Stay away from the Omeglodon! He's my target. Blow him up! Haha. <laughs> Come 
to me. Stop your whining. This is everything as it was meant to be. Except, you know, the Omegalodon winning and such. That's your ticket to freedom. Smash it. No, don't smash it. No. Ah. Oh. That guy's doing some good healing. No! In Byro. All right. What what happened? I'm spectating. Where's the Omegalodon? So this has been Omegalodon, ladies and gentlemen. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I hope you will sincerely consider this game for a purchase. The community is small, but the game, while quirky, has a lot to offer, and it is loads and loads of fun. I hope you enjoyed yourself, and I hope you will join me for the next Dayton Dissects. Until then... <laughs>